Well hello and welcome back. Today we're looking at a 1903 pocket hammerless. This is chambered in 32 ACP. Now you're probably wondering what the heck is up with this gun. Well it's got an experimental target barrel on it. Now this isn't a Colt product. I should say this is a custom target barrel. This barrel was made by Dumond uh, manufacturing. Demond was around in the 1930s and 40s. I believe they did primarily rifle barrels, but obviously they did uh, some pistol barrels too. So this uh, is a great little target gun. You can see that it's got the, uh, it has the uh, modified uh, front sight on it. It has a, a nice square rear sight on it. And uh, let's see, the pistol itself is a uh, the 524,000 serial number range, which puts it into 1937 to 38 for date of manufacture. So somebody had their nice little pocket uh, hammerless and wanted to turn it into a target uh, pistol. Anyway, we're going to go ahead and do a quick field strip of this so you can get a better look at the barrel. And uh, the book that I've referred to in my studies on the pocket hammerless an uh, excellent book by Dr. John uh, Bruner uh, has six of these experimental, or excuse me, six of these known target barrels out there. So this strips just like a regular one, you know, where you take it back to the takedown plug, or excuse me, the takedown arrow, and then you rotate the barrel, and then the entire assembly slides off the front of the frame. Go ahead and set our frame over here. Take a look at that. Get our recoil spring out of there and the guide. And then we'll go ahead and rotate our barrel around in here so you can see those grooves. And then it will pull right off the front. Now, this being an older, or excuse me, uh, one of the newer models of this pistol, it has the barrel bushing integrated onto the front. And then, of course, it has the uh, plug here in the front, too. Anyhow, not to get sidetracked on that, we'll go ahead and take a look at this barrel. So here we have the barrel. You can see nice heavy barrel like that. It must have uh, shot really well. This looks like a fun uh, pistol to take out and shoot. As you can see, I haven't cleaned this one yet. We still have this yellow oil residue on the um, polished barrel. But uh, anyhow, there you go, T uh, a rare target uh, barrel for a 32 ACP. So we'll go ahead and put this pocket hammerless back together, just the same way it came apart. Go in here and get it into the grooves, turn it like that, make sure our recoil spring is in there, and then onto the frame it goes and now we got to get this in okay there it goes into the receiving hole in there now we'll go ahead and slide it on now extreme care needs to be taken with making sure that that spring does not get bent when this is put back on it's really easy for a uh, for these two and then this is the trickiest part, getting these grooves. Sometimes you got to move it back and forth just slightly to get these grooves to line up. There we go. Back in place. Forward again. Go ahead and put our magazine back in. And there you go. Another very neat example of a historic Colt Auto. And uh, with a target barrel on it. Pretty cool old pistol. Sure would be fun to take this out and shoot it. <laughs> anyway, hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.